What's up guys, how good could a $12 battle song from AliExpress be? I don't know, let's go take a look. So here it is, the $12 AliExpress trainer. Now it's available in three colors, I opted for orange. And right off the bat, I like how it has the back spacers and everything. It's got a spring latch, which is also the same color, I like that. I like how it's orange instead of like on the Knob Alley strainer. It's about the exact same size as the Knob Alley strainer. Kind of your generic. Ooh, oops, I'm trying to do an aerial over here. There we go. And uh, it's a bottle opener. It's pretty cool. Like, is this a bottle opener and a can opener? Or are they both just bottle openers? I don't really know. And then I think these are supposed to be like, yeah, for like the heads of screws, for square head screws. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Kind of like a little tool. Oh, it looks like it runs on bearings, I believe. Yeah, it's got stacked washers. There's actually two. You can see that. Yeah, see, right? It's kind of weird. Well, it looks like it got a steel liner. It's just held together with these three screws. It looks like uh, you can take the latch off if you want. Here's how the spring latch is consisted. The balance point is right, right there-ish. So it's a little hand, a little blade heavy, slightly blade heavy, I'd say. Just uh, from feeling it like that. Oops. Yeah, but let's go over there where we got more room. I can adjust the camera. Um, but it feels really like rough here. Like when you compare it to like the knob valley strainer, this is all actually like sanded down and smooth. This is like sharp edges. So that's kind of what you get for twelve bucks. But the the handles feel amazing. It feels like nice. Like it feels like it's like bead blasted or something. Like it's really smooth. It's like it's like if you sanded down G10. Um, where here it feels much rougher and grippier. But there's like a texture to this one. Um, this one there's no texture to it. Like it's totally like looking them next to each other. The G10 is just like really, really nice, uh, aesthetically pleasing in your hand. There's zero play. That's why I I'd assume it's bearings, but without taking it apart, I won't really. I can't really tell. But uh, yeah, the hidden Z pins are nice uh it doesn't feel like it's gonna pinch now because this is really small and just rounded off so that's a very nice design there uh cool and let's that go over there where we got a little more room all right so here we have it and uh once again out of the box there is zero play and uh the grip is really nice it almost feels like too smooth where it's like slipping out of my hand a little bit uh i am absolutely like not an expert by any stretch of the imagination. Um, you know, I just kind of do the same couple tricks over and over again. But I mean, already for $12, I mean, I'm pretty impressed. It doesn't, the balance though, yeah, feels a little off. It's definitely, the balance is not as nice as the knob at least trainer, but it's, you know, still, oh, still pretty nice. But yeah, there, I'm really surprised that there is zero handle plan of $12 one. I was not, yeah, for $12, I was uh, definitely not expecting it to be this nice. I do like that it's a bottle opener, but this is like, like you could almost, I mean, if it hit your knuckles, it would, it doesn't hurt. I definitely, um, I'm going to take this on my belt sander and just like sand off all the edges on it uh, just to make it smooth. Also too, it is a little blade heavy. So by doing that, that might take a little off the blade where it might be kind of perfect. I mean, it's not like really blade heavy, but yeah, it's definitely, definitely noticeable. Whoopsie, in that the grip, it's like too smooth. I do like the texture though. Um, I, I can't like, I don't know how to like choker fan or anything. That's like the next thing I'm going to try to learn. Um, but if you are into fanning, I can tell just from based on like how uh, regular fans feel and stuff, like it will be able to fan. Um, no problem because it is blade heavy though. It'll probably be really good at chaplains. I, I'm not really good at chaplains besides just your basic ones. Um, but just from doing your basic standard chaplain, like you could feel that the extra blade weight actually helps for that. So, so those those type of tricks, you might appreciate the extra blade. Um, but also, once again, these sharp edges, you will feel them on tricks like that. Um, but um, overall, it is pretty comfortable in my hand. Um, the only thing is, yeah, I wish there was a little bit more grip, if anything. Um, it's just mostly up here. On the bottom, this is very nice and it sticks out. I don't know if you can see. Uh, it's not flush, it actually sticks out, which uh, in my opinion, you know, actually helps. But, you know, once again, I'm no expert, so take it with a grain of salt. 
Oh, I just like doing aerials over and over again, and uh, that's kind of my thing. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Damn. So, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Definitely check it out. I'll put the link down below. Once again, I got an AliExpress. 12 bucks. Comes in three colors. Um, and it's uh, as I can tell, it's no, it's not a clone or anything, so that's pretty cool. It's just a twelve dollar trainer. So if you're, you know, first starting out, this ain't not a bad option. Uh, definitely take some sandpaper or take it on your belt sander and sand off those edges. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, appreciate the support. Smash that like button, or I'll be really mad. Peace.